nothing as low as two dollars at one stage. All right. Green light goes on. No more bets. Set to go. Here's race seven at Gawler. Ready now. Set to go. Away, Dusty Country only fair away. Hunts up on the inside, but Darwin O'Connor's going to get across it. Favourite has to work hard. Cop the bump there going forward. Came and went, and in the meantime, pushing through was Dusty Country to take the lead. Victor Jess in second placing. Came and went about three lengths away. Third, then Benetoit. The others are racing back there by themselves. They're too far back to feature. My Villanelle, Darwin O'Connor, and Maltese News in front. Dusty Country. Coming at it, Victor Jess, though. Victor Jess trying to pick up Dusty Country. He's got the kick. Dusty Country gets it. Beats Victor Jess. Third was came and went. Fourth placing, Bill Toit, then Darwin O'Connor. Then in turn behind those, uh, we had uh, Maltese News and Mike Villanelle pulling up together at the tail end of the field. And the run is 31-30, 1-8-6. Dusty Country gets home. 1-8-6-7, the judges' numbers. A little bit of luck on the first turn was getting squeezed up. The others bumped, but showed good courage to push through underneath them. In particular, Darwin O'Connor, who began better. And she set up a lead down the back straight. Victor Jess was starting to make ground on her and looked a good chance of beating her. But Dusty Country shepherded her lead and uh, just dodged and weaved and just blocked Victor Jess from running it down. One eight six seven. They've landed the plonk. 31.30 the time. A length by three and three quarters after race number six here at Gawler.